this video is intended for adults, contains sexual themes and extreme violence. No child should be watching this. Thank you. I say we meet once more for the horror festivities. Today I will talk about the Bunny Game, a 2010 low budget horror film. The film is about a prostitute who is abducted by a truck driver who is psychotic. And he plays a very, very extreme torturous game with the prostitute. Let's dive in. So here we have Bunny, a drug addicted prostitute who encounters a psychotic truck driver. They meet with Bunny thinking or under the impression that the guy wants a sexual act done to her, given that she's a prostitute. So, everything seems normal. They're doing drugs together, laughing a little bit, and then the trucker makes Bunny feel uncomfortable. So she tries to leave. The trucker stops her from leaving, chokes her, unconscious and that's where the film takes a very 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 bad turn I'm talking about from torture to R A P E they have those scenes you definitely could tell that Bunny struggles with a lot of things she even gets robbed throughout the film just trying to get by or support her habit, if you will. But even the trick or the job, however you want to address them, they rob her. So we have this psychotic trucker who's living out every sick nightmare possible that his sick, demented brain can think of. That's pretty much the whole film. Just that trucker having his way with this woman throughout the film. The United Kingdom, the British Board of Film Classification deemed this film unsuitable due to its graphic scenes of sexual and physical abuse. The Bunny Game is listed at number 37 in Complex Magazine's 50 Most Disturbing Films of All Time. And it was banned in the United Kingdom by the British board. So a film about a drug addicted prostitute and a psychotic truck driver banned off a small budget. This film was produced off a small budget. I just let you know the psychotic nature of this film and just the sheer terror of this film, the creepiness of it. If you can stand sexual depravity and physical abuse and torture at the highest degree, this is a film for you. You can try it. It's not for the faint of heart. You can't be weak-minded watching it. 
Don't be shy.